The need for reform to reduce litigations arising from medical negligence in Nigeria has been stressed due to the problematic nature of the existing system. Retired uh, uh, Justice Mary Odile made the call at the Nigerian Medical Association Annual General Meeting and Scientific Conference in Patakot, the River State Capital. The exodus of medical personnel to greener pastures outside the shores of this country, litigation in medical practice and emerging trend was a theme of the gathering where the stakeholders raised some concerns. Chairman of the occasion, retired Justice Mary Audley commended the enemy for creating awareness on the need for medical doctors to sit up and be vigilant in the discharge of their duty to avoid litigation. Law and practice of Nigeria in relation to medical negligence litigation need urgent reform due to the problematic nature of the existing system. There are considerable shortages in human resources for health across all three levels of health care delivery. The incessant brain drain or Japa syndrome of doctors and nurses from Nigeria to wealthier countries has widened the already pre-existing gaps. The cultural and religious attitudes in parts of Nigeria tend to weaken the assertion by patients of knowing their rights. On his part, chairman of the Nigerian Medical Association, River State Chapter, Dr. Ebi Robinson, described the issues of brain drain as a natural disaster and wants the federal government to improve on the welfare and security of medical personnel. The Commissioner of Health, Adaize Ore, said one of the ways to address brain drain was adopting holistic approach from all sectors. What prompted the team is because of the level of brutality and to create awareness for our medical community so that doctors will be aware of their rights and know when to ensure that um, the practice is optimal and to know that there are a lot of praise here and there that I will, we want to take advantage of the practice, especially when their misconcept action or outcome is not the outcome of medical treatment. If you, if you look at the provisions of the physician's oath, it's a guide to how to conduct oneself as a physician. But when we talk about litigation, there's also the need for um, physicians to be aware of litigation as something that is coming to stay building capacity and that's why we commend the Nigeria Medical Association for highlighting this by making it the focus of their conference this year. So that not just the physicians but also patients and their families are aware of their rights because litigation we know can go both ways. So the issue of uh, medical malpractice, medical negligence and errors and the like is the center of this discussion and that at any time in the course of practice, they can be called to account for any carelessness and any malpractice, misdiagnosis. It's not as if um, the way doctors practice, that they have a guarantee that it must end up good. No. However, they should not be seen to be careless. That laser fair era is over. It's time for, for you to be sober, vigilant. Because there's a duty of care and there's a standard of care that is a body that you must discharge in exonerating yourself. The River State Governor, Siminalaye Fubara, however promised to collaborate with the Nigerian Medical Association in the state in seeking sustainable ways to boost the capacity of the state physician's workforce. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.